The delivery of the Philippines' third Spider MR air defense missile battery highlights a pivotal moment in the nation's quest to strengthen its territorial defense. Operated by the 960th Air and Missile Defense Group at Basa Air Base, this system is a vital addition under the Horizon 2 phase of the revised AFP modernization program. To assess its significance, it is useful to compare the Spider MR with China's HQ-6 and HQ-17 systems, evaluating their strengths and roles in air defense. This analysis underscores how the Spider MR contributes to the Philippines' evolving defense framework. The Spider MR is an advanced medium-range air defense system developed by Israel's Rafael Advanced Defense Systems. It leverages sophisticated interceptor missiles like the IDERBY ER, which offers extended range capabilities, and the Python 5, renowned for its dual infrared and electro optical guidance. The Spider's mobility and rapid deployment capability make it ideal for defending dynamic and critical infrastructure. It employs the ELM 2106 ATAR 3D radar, which provides 360 degree surveillance and engagement coverage enabling it to counter diverse threats, including aircraft, UAVs, and precision-guided munitions. Its modular architecture and adaptability across different missions set it apart as a versatile solution for air defense. In terms of technical specifications, the Spider MR offers a maximum interception range of up to 50 kilometers and an altitude coverage of 16 kilometers. The ELM-2106 ATAR radar can detect targets at ranges exceeding 70 kilometers, providing ample warning and engagement time. Its vertical launch capability ensures 360-degree coverage, and its interceptor missiles are designed to engage high speed and maneuvering targets effectively. In contrast, China's HQ-6 is a derivative of the older HQ-61 system and is designed to offer short to medium range air defense. It uses missiles based on the PL-11 air-to-air -air missile, providing effective defense against low altitude threats like drones and helicopters. The HQ-6 has a maximum range of approximately 18 kilometers and an altitude coverage of 10 kilometers. However, its radar and command systems are relatively basic compared to modern systems like the Spider mr The HQ-6's semi-active radar guidance limits its independence and flexibility in dynamic operational scenarios. While adequate for point defense, the HQ-6 does not offer the same level of mobility, modularity, or advanced multi-threat engagement capabilities as the Spider mr Meanwhile, the HQ-17, based on the Russian Tor M1 system, represents a more modern and mobile solution in China's air defense arsenal. It is designed for short-range, high-mobility engagements and excels at intercepting low-altitude, high-speed targets, such as cruise missiles and drones. The HQ-17's maximum range is approximately 15 kilometers, with an altitude coverage of 10 kilometers. Equipped with phased array radar and vertical launch capabilities, the HQ-17 is highly effective for tactical deployments. However, its short-range focus limits its applicability for broader area defense. Unlike the Spider MR, which offers medium-range protection and adaptability for extended missions, the HQ-17 is primarily a battlefield system rather than a strategic air defense asset. Beyond technical specifications, the broader operational roles of these systems reveal key differences in their strategic value. The Spider MR's flexibility makes it suitable for both fixed and mobile deployments, ensuring that critical infrastructure, including airports, power plants, and military bases, can be effectively shielded from aerial threats. Its ability to integrate seamlessly with other air defense and command and control systems further enhances its effectiveness as part of a layered defense network. This interoperability ensures that the Spider MR can work alongside radar and sensor systems from various manufacturers, a crucial advantage for a nation like the Philippines, which relies on a mix of imported defense technologies. On the other hand, the HQ-6 and HQ-17 are more specialized systems. The HQ-6's focus on defending low-altitude targets like helicopters and drones limits its utility in scenarios requiring broader area defense. While it is suitable for point defense, 
its effectiveness diminishes when integrated into a larger air defense network. Similarly, the HQ-17's primary role in battlefield air defense aligns it more with tactical operations rather than strategic applications. While its mobility is impressive, allowing it to quickly reposition and respond to dynamic threats, its limited range and engagement envelope restrict its role to localized conflicts rather than comprehensive national defense. Another aspect to consider is the technological sophistication of these systems. The Spider mrs advanced missile technology, including the Python 5 and iDerby ER, enables it to engage targets with exceptional precision. The Python 5's electro-optical and infrared seekers allow for lock-on after-launch capabilities, providing unmatched versatility in engaging fast-moving and highly maneuverable threats. The iDerby ER, with its extended range and active radar guidance, offers a critical edge in intercepting threats at greater distances, ensuring that hostile aircraft or missiles can be neutralized before reaching critical infrastructure. In comparison, the HQ-6's reliance on semi-active radar guidance limits its precision and flexibility. Semi-active systems require continuous radar tracking of the target, which can be disrupted by electronic warfare measures or adverse weather conditions. The HQ-17's phased array radar and vertical launch capabilities represent an improvement, but its missile technology does not match the extended range or advanced guidance features of the Spider mrs interceptors. This technological gap underscores the Spider mrs superiority as a modern air defense system. The geopolitical implications of acquiring these systems also warrant attention. The Spider MR's Israeli origin reflects the Philippines' strategic alignment with nations that prioritize technological innovation and reliability in defense. This partnership not only ensures access to cutting-edge technologies, but also fosters bilateral cooperation in training and operational support. Conversely, reliance on Chinese systems like the HQ-6 and HQ-17 may raise concerns about interoperability with allied forces, particularly given the broader geopolitical dynamics in the region. Compatibility with systems used by allies like the United States further enhances the Spider MR's value to the Philippines, ensuring that joint operations and exercises can be conducted seamlessly. The Spider MR's deployment by the Philippine Air Force marks a significant enhancement in the country's defensive posture. As a medium-range system, it provides a critical layer of protection that bridges the gap between short-range tactical systems and long-range strategic defenses. Its ability to engage multiple threats simultaneously enhances its utility in protecting key infrastructure, population centers, and military installations. Furthermore, its mobility and quick reaction capabilities align with the PAF's operational needs in a geographically fragmented archipelago like the Philippines. By comparison, the HQ-6's limited flexibility and dated technology make it less suited for modern, multifaceted air defense requirements. The HQ-17, while advanced, lacks the range and adaptability to serve as a comprehensive defense solution. The Spider MR's balance of range, mobility, and advanced guidance systems positions it as a superior choice for the Philippines which faces diverse aerial threats in a complex regional security environment. In conclusion, the Spider MR's acquisition represents a forward-looking investment in the Philippines' air defense capabilities. Its technical advantages over systems like the HQ-6 and HQ-17 highlight its role as a cornerstone of the country's modern air defense architecture. By integrating the Spider MR into its defense framework, the Philippines is not only enhancing its ability to safeguard national sovereignty, but also contributing to regional stability. This system serves as a critical deterrent against external threats, ensuring that the nation's skies remain secure in an increasingly complex security environment. As the Philippines continues to fortify its military under the revised AFP modernization program, the Spider MR's deployment underscores a broader commitment to national defense, technological advancement, and strategic collaboration with global partners.